Hi, and welcome to Practice Your English with Brimbank Libraries. My name's Sarah. In each of these videos, we'll give you a word of the week, conversation topic, and weekly Aussie slang. This week, we're looking at greetings and introducing yourself. Let's start with our word of the week. Our word of the week is greeting. Greeting is a noun or naming word. It means a word or action used to show welcome. Some examples of greetings are hello, hi, good morning, giving a wave, and g'day. We also use greetings to talk about when we wish someone well or hope they are well. This is a more formal use of the word. For example, we might send a card, letter, or email saying season's greetings at special times of the year. At a formal event, someone might say, warm greetings to you all. Can you write or say a sentence with the word greeting in it? This week's conversation topic is introducing yourself. When we meet someone, we usually give them a greeting, such as saying, hello. If it's the first time we've met someone, we usually also introduce ourselves by giving a bit of information about ourselves, such as our name and some things that we think the person might want to know. The way we introduce ourselves often depends on where we are or why we're there. For example, if I introduce myself to you as part of this video, I could say, hi, my name is Sarah and I'm from Brimbank Libraries. I start with my greeting, hi, then give my name, Sarah, and then something I think you might want to know. I work for Brimbank Libraries. If I was introducing myself to you during a session of Practice Your English in the library, I might say, Hi, my name's Sarah. I was born in Sydney and have been in Melbourne for 10 years. Along with my greeting and name, I'm telling you about where I have lived in the past. If I was introducing myself at a book club, I might say, Hi, my name's Sarah and I like reading science fiction and fantasy, which tells you what type of books I like to read. Now it's your turn. If you are living with someone else who speaks English, practice introducing yourself to them. If you aren't, you could practice by writing down how you would introduce yourself. Don't forget to include a greeting, your name, and something about yourself you think the other person might want to know. If you want some feedback, why not call your local Brimbank Library for a phone practice your English session? If you call your nearest branch at these times, a staff member will chat with you for a minimum of 15 minutes where you can practice your conversation skills. Aussie slang. This week's Aussie slang is G'day. This is probably the most well known of all Aussie slang, but it isn't actually used that often anymore, particularly in the cities. We do still sometimes say g'day, but not as much as we used to. G'day is a greeting and means good day. Australians tend to like to abbreviate or shorten words or form contractions where two words are squished into one word. In this case, we take the two words good and day and squish them into g'day. So when might you hear or say g'day? Anytime you would hear or say a greeting. So anytime you might say, hello, hi, or good morning, you could also say, g'day. That's it for this Practice Your English video. Don't forget, we also offer Practice Your English over the phone. Check out the link in the description below for more details. And why not check out our other videos? Are you missing borrowing library items? We have a library to your door delivery service for Brimbank residents. Ring your local Brimbank library for more details. Thank you for joining us and we look forward to seeing you again next time. Bye.